Hello everyone, welcome back to session number two of what to do when you're a newly licensed agent. My name is Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO, that's right, Chief Everything Officer here at Independence Title, coming to you with a video talking about what is the second thing you need to do. Well, if you remember in the previous video, we talked about getting your license at an office. So now you have picked an office you would love to work with, you need to join your local realtor association. So whether it, we're in South Florida, you join the one in Fort Lauderdale, you join the one in Miami, each association, just like when we talked about picking a broker, each association has different benefits, different locations, what MLS are they part of, what classes do they offer, who are their leaders and how long have they been in real estate, what do they do on the charitable side of things, what events do they have, which we'll talk about in a later video when we talk about networking as a new agent. So researching and selecting your local board is very, very important. If you go to certain offices, they might have members at all of the boards. So you want to ask the people, what board are you with? And what are the benefits that you're receiving from that board of realtors? It's very important to select a board that is going to align with your values, have classes you want to learn, have networking events you want to go to, maybe have a charitable side to it, but most importantly, hold your hand through being a successful real estate agent. I always tell people you may not necessarily need your office and the training versus the training your board offers. That's why you join the local realtor association so you can get the training you need to be a superstar agent. So that's video number two. Research your board, figure out which one aligns with your values and apply for membership. My name's Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO here at Independence Title. That's right, your chief everything officer. And as always, I look forward to seeing you at the closing table. Bye-bye for now.